Unraveling Unbiased Approach, a simple guide. Hello everyone, today we're going to delve into a very interesting English phrase, unbiased approach. Understanding this phrase is not just about learning new words, but also about grasping a concept that is vital in many aspects of our lives, from news reporting to everyday decision-making. Let's unravel its meaning together. First, let's break down the term unbiased. The word unbiased combines the prefix un, meaning not, with the word biased. Being biased means having a preference for or against something in a way that is unfair or prejudiced. Therefore, unbiased means not having such preferences or prejudices. It's about being fair, impartial, and objective. Think of it like a judge in a court, not favoring any side. Now, let's look at the word approach. In this context, an approach refers to a way or method of dealing with something or considering a matter. It's like the path you choose to walk on when you're facing a problem or a situation. An approach can be methodical, emotional, logical, etc depending on how you decide to handle things. Combining these two words, unbiased approach, means a method or way of handling things that is fair and impartial, without personal feelings, prejudices, or preferences influencing the outcome. This is especially important in situations where a clear, objective view is needed. Imagine a scientist conducting an experiment. They must observe and report the results without letting personal beliefs interfere. An unbiased approach is crucial in many fields. In journalism, it ensures that news is reported factually and fairly. In science, it guarantees that results are accurate and not swayed by personal beliefs. In everyday life, Having an unbiased approach helps us make fair decisions and understand situations more clearly. It's about seeing the world as it is, not just how we want it to be. I hope this video has helped clarify what unbiased approach means and why it's such a valuable concept. Remember, being unbiased is not about having no opinions. It's about not letting those opinions unduly influence your judgment in professional or critical situations. Thank you for watching, and keep exploring the fascinating world of English.